All right, you're gonna be taking a look at ONCI right now, currently traded at 0190. Well, you guys got up to that top right now, which is gonna be obviously the highest seen in quite some time here, uh, going all the way back to 2012. So you guys are hitting a high right now. It's a beautiful way to close that Friday. I'm sure we can all agree on that. One thing I'm gonna be looking forward to here going into next week, uh, right now the current RSI is a little high right now at the 84. However, uh, you guys did go right past all these gaps down here. Didn't even worry about filling them. Uh, even more so over here on September 5th. You guys know how I am with these gaps. I watch them closely. Always have uh, ever since I got into charting. But you guys come up over here, get outside the upper Bollinger Band in August, and then bounce right off of that Burgundy line, which is a 20-day simple moving average. Nice, beautiful climb up here. You guys on the 15th and 16th over that weekend as well. Uh, just a blast off on that Monday, gapping up. Uh, where you're at right now, currently at 0190. What I'm going to be watching for, maybe a little bit more push, or, uh, push up here, uh, especially to 02, two cents. I mean, that's going to be another big level to break, just like one penny was. Uh, number Two cents is going to be another big level. But if you guys get up to there and cannot make it through there, I'd be watching for this 10-day simple moving average underneath that, uh, which is currently at 0137. If it breaks through there, you guys could be filling the gaps, uh, the gaps down here, uh, but by then, my personal opinion is that the 20-day simple moving average is going to be creeping up right behind that. So, uh, giving that the opportunity to bounce off that as soon as it fills at the 0120. So, right now, you guys have two different ways that I would be definitely watching for. Uh, watch for the break of that two cents or, as of right now, in my personal opinion. So, we'll put today's date in here. Uh, I'm going to be watching for that 10-day simple moving average. And I'm going to put that in here right here. Uh, so 0190, watch for the 202 break. If not, could pull down to the 10-day simple moving average. Just keeping it short and sweet uh, to the point with that. So you guys, hopefully that helps you out with ONCI. Remember, over on investorshangout.com, you can check the trades for every single trade uh, for this stock in live time which the uh, time price and volume for each individual trade. So if you guys work all day, you can't watch the trades, you want to come home, check it out. This is going to be the opportunity to do it. Over here on investorshangout.com, make sure you share this video with all other investors and hit that like and subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you on the next video.